Uh, hello, this is uh, Michael Song from Lee and I. Uh, this day we want to uh, demonstrate the temperature and time for the mobile dry RG202. And uh, our president, Mr. Lim, will help me test along with. Uh, so, uh, at first, uh, turn on the main power switch, open the door and take out the frame and uh, for this test we used a uh, temperature tester with a thermal couple attached with the captain tape and the end of tip of the thermal couple touched the LCD of the smartphone which is defective to uh, disassemble the defective smartphone we heat up the defective smartphone with this device close the door and the lamp turn off and then turn on the red button to start heating and factory uh, setting is 80 degrees 5 minutes that means uh, the temperature slowly goes up to 80 degrees and then it, the temperature uh, will remain uh, for 5 minutes and uh, the left smartphone is for the elastic time and uh, back side the temperature tester shows the temperature of the defective smartphone. And also the RG202 can heat up the iPad or Galaxy Pad which is portable and a little larger than smartphone and we developed uh, this machine for those uh, portable devices and uh, now you see the uh, display the value of temperature is 34 uh, now it slowly goes up and the temperature tester is 32.6 there is a little temperature deviation and uh, now it passed uh, 1 minute 27 seconds uh, and for your reference we have also the small size device uh, its model number is RG201 uh, which can heat up the only smartphone and uh, that has sterilization function and uh, uh, now the temperature is 37.9 and the elapsed time is 2 minutes so the captain tape which can withstand uh, about 300 Celsius degrees is attached on the thermal coupler uh, to fix the thermal coupler on the LCD of the defective smartphone. And now the thermal coupler is measuring the temperature of the defective uh, smartphone and the temperature inside of the machine measured by some copper is 42.8 Celsius degrees and the temperature value displayed by the machine is 45 so there are some uh, deviation so it is normal situation uh, this uh, is mainly for uh, verification of the time required to heat up the uh, suitably uh, disassemblable situation because our objective is to disassemble the defective smartphone to repair it so uh, our factory uh, uh, target the temperature 80 degrees and uh, uh, the button under the red is a warm-up button. If you uh, click the button, uh, 
and then uh, this make uh, the uh, temperature of about 45 degrees yeah. oh, 50. Uh, 50 degrees, yeah. 50 degrees uh, can be maintained at least uh, this is mainly for uh, saving the uh, warming up time uh, by setting the limit, lowest limit for the temperature of the inside and uh, if you want to save time for uh, heating up the defective smartphone you need to touch the blue button and uh, the machine will memorize the temperature when you uh, click the blue button so at just now I uh, clicked uh, at, a, at about uh, 50 degrees so the machine memorized that temperature and uh, it will remain at least 50. So uh, although you turn off, uh, uh, although you open up the door and uh, the temperature will cool down, but the uh, uh, lowest temperature will remain at uh, 50, thanks to the uh, warming up function. So, if you have many smartphones uh, to refer, uh, at first time only, you click one time, blue, but blue button, then next time you don't uh, need to wait longer time, as you, as you know. Uh, about three minutes uh, you require the time to warm up uh, about 50 degrees but you can save three minutes by clicking the blue button the machine memorized the lowest limit and uh, for the second uh, uh, defective smartphone uh, you can uh, save the heating time now it elapsed about six minutes Eight seconds. The temperature for the smartphone is 67 Celsius degrees. The display the value is 72. For your reference, um, the smartphone uh, can absorb the environment the heat. So the, actually the inside temperature is higher than the measured temperature of the smartphone. But smartphone can absorb the heat. So the temperature for the smartphone is a little lower than the uh, inside total temperature. Now you just heard the beep sound uh, that alarm you it reached 80 Celsius degrees and now you can see the minute button uh, is blinking 5 that means uh, the time function is undergoing that means uh, at 80 degrees uh, the machine will keep for five minutes and the time will uh, be spent from five minutes, four minutes, three minutes and the present uh, time elapsed is eight minutes 45 seconds but this is for the first defective smartphone for but uh, from next phone thanks to the warming up button of the blue color you can save about three minutes, four minutes, yeah. So 
그래서 편차가 있는 건 <웃음> 편차가 발생되는 거는 핸드폰 자체 열을 떼었기 때문에 네. 핸드폰 자체 열을 식히는 어, 것 때문에 온도가 좀 낮게 표시가 되는 거고 네. 실질적으로 고온의 온도는 표시되는 저 온도로 Actually, the temperature inside of the machine is displayed value of uh, about 82. But because the smartphone uh, take heat uh, from the inside, so the measured temperature for the smartphone is 77. For the first uh, defective smartphone, uh, you have to spend about 8 minutes to reach 80 degrees. Uh, you can fill this time maybe slower, but uh, we developed this machine uh, to heat up the uh, smartphone at slow level. Not to influence the plastic case of the smartphone because we fear that overheat. That means once the temperature go up to 80 degrees, although the going up uh, is stopped, but the temperature tend to uh, go up. So uh, we let the machine uh, heat up slowly, but. For the next second defective smartphone, uh, uh, thanks to the blue button warming up function, you can save time because as long as you touch the blue button, uh, you can use the programmed function of uh, maintaining the lowest limit temperature so you can save uh, the heating time. 이 편차로 이 편차를 최소화하기 위해서는 어, 비슷하게 맞추기 위해서는 어, 플러스 마이너스 5도 정도의 편차를 조정하는 기능이 있다. 거기서 작업을 마치고 설명을 하겠다. There is a function to set the temperature clearance between the temperature measurement device and the machine. Now you see that 75.7 and 81 because you heard the beeping sound now you can take out the smartphone to disassembly uh, Thank you for watching